What's going on guys? Welcome to Goku Runner Talks Tuesday. In this video, i am tell you how to get your picture taken at a race. So maybe you're gonna run your first big race. It's a 5K, 10K, half marathon, or marathon. And you get all dressed up, you, you run your race, you see all the photographers, you're waving at them or whatever. And at the end of the race, you're excited and you wanna see if they captured you on camera. And you go search your name and there's maybe one picture there. You're like, what the freak happened? How could they have missed me? So these are my best five tips on how to get your picture taken at a race. All right, so my first tip on how to get your picture taken during a race is your bib number. You wanna have your bib number on the front of your shirt, uh, anywhere on the front or on your shorts. Uh, make sure your shirt isn't covering it. A lot of people that I see who do races, who are new runners, they tend to put the bib on the back of the shirt. That's not where it belongs. First of all, you wanna have the bib clearly showing on your shirt so the race directors and the race officiants know that you are a paid racer at the race and that you're not banditing the race. So if it's on the back, they're not gonna see that. They might actually pull you off the course or whatever, not that I've seen that before, but that is a possibility. And also, number two is for the picture. This number that you have when you register is what the photographers use to catalog you in their photo book. So make sure you have your bib clearly shown on the front of your person, uh, anywhere on the front, like I said, on the front of your shirt or on your shorts. So that's number one tip on how to get your picture taken during a race. Number two, is you ever run a race and you see little kids at the race. That's awesome. Sometimes you're running and those little kids are fast little suckers and they're running right next to you. And if a photographer sees that little kid and you running right next to each other, the likelihood of you getting your picture taken is almost zero. You're not gonna get your picture taken. They're gonna point their camera lens at that kid and they're gonna take a couple of shots of him or her and your picture will be nowhere to be seen because they did not point the camera at you. So make sure you're not running next to a little kid when you see a photographer. You either wanna slow down or speed up when you see those little kids because the photographer ain't gonna take a picture of you, it's gonna be of that little kid. So my second tip is don't run next to little kids next to a photographer. Number two, my second tip on how to get your picture taken at a race is to not run next to a person in costume. Uh, people have great costumes at races, and if you're not one of them, uh, maybe there's a lady wearing a tutu, maybe a man wearing a tutu, maybe they have a great costume, but if you're running next to that person whenever the photographer's there, chances are you won't get your picture taken because the photographer is again gonna point their lens at something more interesting. They've, at this point, they've seen hundreds of thousands of runners, and their eye and lens is gonna see a more interesting topic, which is gonna be that person in the costume or tutu and take a picture of them and not of you. So make sure to avoid running next to a person in a tutu or costume. That's my number three tip. My fourth tip, so like I said, photographers can get a little bored out there whenever they're just sitting there and seeing a runner after runner doing the same thing, just running. But what you wanna do as my fourth tip is to pose for the photographer when you see them. That could be either by my favorite, flexing, you can flex for the camera, do whatever silly pose you wanna do. The cameraman, the camera woman will see that and take a shot of you. You could even do some acrobatic. I've seen lots of runners to jump up in the air to get the photographer's attention and they will get their picture taken. Just be careful because I know some runners have actually injured themselves after they jumped up in the air. Maybe they landed wrong or they pulled a muscle. Uh, so just be careful on that. Take it at your own risk, but make sure to pose for the cameraman. Maybe you could point at the cameraman. Just make sure you're posing and they will take a picture of you. My fifth and final tip on how to get your picture taken during the race is to be like me. Bring your own camera. You could take your own selfie camera, record a video, become a running YouTuber like me, or take a selfie wherever, whenever you want. You can see the best angle that you want and take a picture of yourself during the race. That's one of the best ways, and it's one of the cheapest ways to get your picture done at the race because, of course, you're taking your own picture. So you don't have to pay for the photographer's fee that they charge whenever you wanna get a high quality pic of yourself at the race. So yeah, those are my five best tips on how to get your picture taken during a race. Hope you guys enjoyed this. 
Uh, if you did, leave me a comment down below, let me know. Please leave me a thumbs up, that really helps me out on this channel. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out. Thank you.